I was trying to figure out how to heat a home in, in the cold climates without spending a lot of money, and I saw this article. It was recommended to me by a friend who works for the EPA called Build a Simple Solar Heater. Now, this system is basically a, a box. house pulls cool air out of your house. It goes through this solar collector, and I'll show you pictures of it in a moment, and then it uh, actually will uh, heat the air considerably. Now, outside temperature is in the 70s, I think. And here's our solar collector, but take a look here at the difference. Okay, the outside temperature is 69.4 degrees. The temperature inside the box is 136 degrees. So, see, that'd be 30, that'd be uh, 66 degrees spread. And what I'm amazed is that, I don't know if you can tell this, but at the top of it, on the back part, the only way the hot air can get out is that little hole in the back. Can you see it? And uh, I'll zoom in right there. And this is on the outside of the house, but uh, the idea is you dig a hole in the wall, you put an air vent there, and actually you get free air coming through. It, the chimney effects in, it's blowing without the benefit of even a fan, and it's an amazing free way to heat your house. In my case, I took some polycarbonate, and I used two kinds. Actually, one is a doubled walled polycarbonate sheet like this, and uh, it's very durable, it's hail resistant, lasts for 20 or 30 years. And then I used a corrugated polycarbonate. And let me show you that. Here you see is a corrugated polycarbonate. You can see that it has ridges in it, if you can catch them, and they're going up and down about a half an inch. And simply, I simply took two befores. I don't know if you can make it out, but two befores, solid back wall. I cut. Well, what I wanted you to see is what this thing looks like by the side of the house. It does make a, a reflective, of course the reflection is part of the beauty of this, but look at this, uh, this is an authentic log home. And, but take a look again at the temperature spread outside and in this heat box. And uh, this is what's amazing, because this is free energy, just a minute, a little bit of work. All right, outside, it's 81.1 Fahrenheit, and inside the box, it's 127 degrees. So you've got a, let's see, 30. Uh, you've got a 40 or 50 degree spread there, which is not bad for free heat. And if you put your hand in the top hole at the back of the box, yeah, we've created a chimney effect here. And I put my hand here, and literally there is a breeze of hot air flowing out here. No fan, no electricity, no wiring. My total cost in preparing this out of just some polycarbonate that I had laying around and some, was $6 for the silicone. I used to seal it up and it's not totally sealed yet. Well, this is Ben Booth. It's a great way to make heat from a box if you put a small electric fan or a solar powered fan at the front and you cut a hole through the wall the book from the epa says this will heat anywhere from a 500 to a thousand foot area so if you put two or three of these you could heat a 2,000 square foot house for free and if you're getting a 40 to 50 degree differential even in the winter time when the temperature is maybe 50 degrees you're still going to get a 90 degree blast of hot air in there or let's say the wind is 32 degrees outside add 40 to that 32 plus 40 72 degrees ben booth reporting from the mountaintop